Come on, give it to me! Are you fucking kidding me? Thank you. I just don't want to fucking deal with you guys. Sorry, bro. No offense. You're just not that interesting. Didn't I just see you in the other place? 55,000 days. That is how long it has been. I've been waiting all this time. Undead counting the passage of time? Don't make me laugh. You still have human traits, creature. Human, you say? I have passed far beyond the realm of such small-minded, short-lived fools. You shall pay for the sins you have waged. In the name of Lord Odin, I shall sanction thee. So badass. Well, you know what? Oh, jeez. Lorenta, why don't you show him how you feel about that? Oops. Ah, oh, whatever, see that too. Lorenta, why don't you show him how you feel about this? You're dunked on. Reflect armor? Well, since this is Lord Odin's rightful property, I'm sure he'd be very happy to get this back. Nope. Of course, the slashing sword farewell is said that Lord Odin used this in his time as a half-elf. But, uh... That's mine now. And the Tear of the Cosmos. It's so beautiful. Also mine now. Can we just leave this way or do I fucking go all the way back? Ugh. Alright, well. Nope. Slashing sword, farewell. Sword whose damage increases by 5% each time a hit is made, up to a maximum of plus 200%. That's pretty fucking good. Now, what are these other two items? Tear of the Cosmos. Oh. Lol. That's just funny. Huh. Armor whose true power has already been lost. Still has 1500 defense. Cool. We did it, guys. We beat it. Oh, it looks like all the enemies despawned after I won. Ugh, so I'm gonna fucking take this long ass route back. Water levels suck. Always have, always will.
make it all watery again then. I mean, why are you guys show me your fucking grody ass demon face? I know there's some fucking hot ass mermaid statues, it's alright. Let me fucking leave, man. Thank you. And this way. And push these back in. I believe that's our only two dungeons for this go, which means we're gonna have to say goodbye to Lucian, everybody. Sorry for that feedback, I'm not sure why that's happening. Alright, let me double check to make sure there's nothing else we have to do this round. But, uh... It's looking like it might be time for us to say goodbye to Lucian. Let's do one last spiritual concentration. Actually, we're gonna restart the fucking program because that fucking buzzing noise is not alright. spiritual concentration before we bid Lucian adieu. And bring Lawfer back into the party, I guess. Alright. Guess this is it then, Lucian. Sorry, bro. send you with gear, but not like super amazing gear. Sorry, man. Guess now we'll just go ahead and give you one rank in everything. Rooney, man. Gonna miss you. Alright, guys. Say goodbye to our best fucking character of all time. Wait. <laughs> he still can't send him even though it's lit up. <laughs> Ah, uh, that's funny as shit. Something weird about to happen? Uh, it totally is. Lucian, what is it that has taken root so deeply in your soul that it troubles you still? If you do not wish to answer, I will leave you be. However, I must remind you that you cannot accept your death until you have left your worldly troubles behind.
What is it, Lucian? Have you decided to speak? Would you go with me to that village? I have no objection. It's like we're getting the special cutscene early, I think. I was born in this village. We always used to play here, the two of us. Oh god. Poor Lucian. friend. This was her house. I hated her parents. They were always so cruel to her. But Platina got upset when I spoke ill of them, so I tried to keep my mouth shut. Her name was Platina. Hmm? Yeah. We were so close, but... But? One day I found out that her parents were going to sell her. We escaped together. I was just a dumb kid back then. I couldn't think of any other way. I wouldn't let anything happen to her, no matter what. In the dark of night, we ran until our lungs were about to burst. Just like this. I'm not really moving that fast. And then we stumbled onto this place. Your helmet. Could you take it off? This girl. And that's why... I know it's wrong to feel this way about a stranger just because she looks like someone else. But nothing has changed. I still love her. Oh my god. Poor Lucian. You see a semblance of your first love when you look at me.